Hello everybody! Today I have played at least four missions or something. This is going to be the last episode, right? I don't know how long this episode is going to be. I don't know if I might split it into two parts or what. But in this episode, things are going to come to an end. And they're gonna, I'm going to have to piece them together. So I'm going to have to probably stop a lot and whatever else. But wow, this is the last one. This is the final mission. We've finally made it. Wow. So I just want to play this, finish the game, and love it. It feels mental that only a few days ago I was only like a third of the way through this game. Wow. Obviously, I've still got a lot of trophies to get, but they will all be getting got in this episode. So Madison's at the hospital, for some reason. Oh yeah, she's seeing Anne Shepherd, right. And Anne Shepherd is uh, a little bit strange. Which is, well, she's not strange, but she's. Hello, I'm looking for Anne Shepherd's room. Please sign the visitor's book. Uh oh. I don't want to. What if I don't want to? People will figure Are you out a I was of here. The family? Yeah, you could say that. Oh, she'll be pleased to have a visitor. No one ever comes to see her. With the Alzheimer's, she has trouble remembering things, but it'll still please her, you know. How nice. It's room 19 at the end of the corridor. Thank you. John Shepard died 30 years ago. Hope his mother has all the answers to this puzzle. 30 years ago. Mental. It's right here. Got a lot to do here. Hello, Mrs. Shepherd. Anne, how nice to see Is you. Is it time for my pills already? Nope. No, Mrs. Shepherd, I... They're never on time with my pills. I don't know what they do here. In the oh. other hospital, they were always on time. But here... My name is Madison Page. I'm a journalist. I'd like to ask you some questions about your son. I don't like this hospital. The food isn't very good, you know. Oh. Uh, John. Do you remember John? My Johnny. He is a good little boy, you know. Carnaby Square. I know what happened at Carnaby Square. Do you remember? Carnaby Square. I think I used to live there a long time ago. We didn't have much money at the time, you know. Mm -hmm. We had to make do with very little. Uh, what's next? Carnaby Square, second son. Your other son, Mrs. Shepherd, John's twin brother. What was his name? What other son? I have no other son. I never had any children. Ugh. I think your son is in trouble, Mrs. Shepherd. He's done some terrible things. I need to find him. Do you understand? Terrible things you're telling me. He never oh. came to see me. Can you believe it? In ten years, never. Ten years? No one man. forgets their mother, do they? Foster family. Try to remember, Mrs. Shepherd. John's twin brother was placed with a foster family after the accident. What was the name of the foster family? I asked them for a television, you know. They said I didn't have enough money. It's a pity. Oh. I'm fond of television. Oh, and here are they talking about, or where are you talking about? You had a son named John, and John had a twin brother. Do you have my pills? It's time for my pills. No, it's not. Mrs. Time Shepherd, for answers. Your son may be linked to a series of murders. Perhaps you have some information that could help the investigation. Are you a new nurse? Where are my pills? You don't seem to get many flowers, Mrs. Shepherd. Oh, just because there's not any just no, now? No, but I love them. My son knows that I love flowers. 
I know he'll bring me some. Did you make these origami figures? My little paper animals. They played with them for hours. I showed my boys how to make them, you know. Ooh. Yes, your boys, Mrs. Shepherd. John and what was your other son's name again? My other son? I only had one son. Come on, my little please. Johnny. It'd take days, if not longer, to find the name of the family that adopted her son. Not a chance. Sean Mars would be dead by then. Get in there. What a lovely orchid. Orchid? My <gasps> sons loved orchids. We used to grow them in the back. When John died, I laid orchids on his grave. Oh. I'll do this one. Yeah. Oh, that seems so easy. Oh, you know how to do these little dogs, too. My children loved origami. I taught them how to do it. John loved the little dogs. Really? He always wanted to call them Max. Max, Max, Max. All dogs with the same name. I was wasting my time telling him they couldn't all have the same name. Wow. But he always wanted his paper dogs Max. It's funny, isn't it? <laughs> yes, it certainly is. This. Are these your children, Mrs. Shepherd? John and his brother? Is that them? They're good little boys. Their father never looked after them. Mm. Always yeah, I saw that drinking. in the flashback. They didn't have an easy life, you know. Hence the reason he died. It was pretty hard. I cried when they told me. I'd already lost one of my children, and now they were taking away another one, you understand? Oh. The foster family, Mrs. Shepherd. What was the name of the foster family that adopted John's brother? What was it? Come on. They were really very nice people. I met them, you know. In the beginning, I used to go and see my little boy. How sweet. And then I got sick, and I couldn't go any longer. Perhaps he thought I'd forgotten him. He must have oh, thought sad. I didn't love him anymore. His name, Mrs. Shepherd. What was his name? But I loved him. If you only knew how much I missed him. Oh. Please, Anne. His name. What was his name? Come closer. <gasps> She's gonna tell me. Can we hear it? What is it? What is it? Turn up the volume. <gasps> Who is it? Who is it? Is it Norman? Who is it? No, it wouldn't be now. She seems shocked. Does she know who it is then? I don't understand. Does she know who he is? Poor woman. Just left here on her own. Do you know who it is, Madison? She seems to know who it is. I don't know who it is. Do you know who... Well, a lot of people do know who it is because this game is ancient. But I'm I do know who it is, right? But that enough of that, right? 
The last letter is blah de blah. So this is another thing that has two choices, and the choice we're about to make, I'm not a big fan of, but we've got to do it, right? Got to do it because I get trophies for it. I really don't like that. So look at how grand this place is as well. What is this place? The last trial. The last question. Are you prepared to give your life to save your son? There is a deadly poison in this file. It will kill you in exactly 60 minutes. Oh. If you drink it, you will get the last letters of the address. You will have enough time to save your son and say goodbye to him, but then you will die. At least they gave me time to say you goodbye to him. You can drink the files or decide to leave. The choice is yours. I will drink it for my son. How sad. I don't like this. I don't want to drink it, but I have to drink it. How is it hitting me right away? This person must, the origami killer must be pretty smart as well. If they can, you know, find a, something that will kill me in a certain amount of time. Mental. Well, that's creepy. Why am I shaking like that? This is the last time you'll see your face, basically. The last letters have been sent to your phone. Feet Roosevelt what? Road. Ah, Roosevelt Road, not Lane. I did tell you it was Roosevelt. I did what I had to, Sean. Your dad's coming to save you. Such a shame you're gonna die though. That doesn't make sense. So there's another way where he doesn't die, but I have to figure out how to do that way. Just let me see that I get my trophy. That's one trophy. Right, so that's the other way to get the other rat trophy. Um, we will then be going to play with Norman, but this time I'm not taking the thingy. This is the way I would like to do it, but supposedly we don't do it this way. Kill myself to save Sean? That's ridiculous. I'll find some other way. I'm sure I can save him. Bye. I'll find you, Sean. I'll figure out a way and I'll come and get you, son. He does. This is like, this is legitimately a better way, but we can't do it this way. This is only my third time we trying this. This is ridiculous. Just a slim, 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 I can't speak. What I have to do is use my phone first, right? It's ridiculous. I mean, we all know where the address is by now, but he doesn't. I'm nowhere and I'm out of time. Damn fucking shitty letters from this fucking, fucking address! Come on! There's gotta be a way to do this! Phone. Several different addresses fit these letters. God, they're scattered all over the city. I don't have time to check them all. I may only have time for one address. If Sean's not there, I'm done. It's a crapshoot.
Right, so as you will have just heard from me, I went through hell. I went through three different missions, right, just to get the Clever Dad trophy. I didn't realise I had to basically complete the whole story to get the trophy, but... Okay, we're going to start from Norman Jaden, which I've already done, but I'll do it again for you because I didn't record it, obviously, because I wasn't actually playing through it, but we'll do it this time, don't you worry. I kind of know what to do with all this situation and that. We're nearing the end though, we're so near the end, we're so near the end, we're so near the end. I don't know which one is my favourite character, I do like them all. I really like Norman Jaden though, he's such an interesting guy. And he's always right, like, always right. We've only got a few more hours left to save Sean Mars. Well I know who it is. There has I know. to be a goddamn clue somewhere. Do you know who it is? If you've never seen face. this game before, this I won't tell you yet. Die, but it's been staring you in the face the whole time, I'll just say that. All packed up and ready to go. What are you talking about? The investigation's Don't like you, over. Carter. We know who did it. We no longer need your services anymore, Norman. So you can ride your files all the way back to Washington. I hate you. I'd be lying if I said I was going to miss you. You're the worst, by the way. The investigation isn't over. You have absolutely nothing on Mars. Mars say is that guilty. Again. Case closed. Anyway, it's no concern of yours now. You're off the case. So pack up and fuck off. Why don't you? Blake, you are an unbalanced, do that. psychopathic asshole. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Honestly, I don't give a shit what you think. I found the origami killer. Everyone's happy. End of story. I'm not. Have a nice trip back, Norman. You are the worst. What? How did he ever become a cop? How? So I've done this once before. I can do this again. Don't do it, Norman. Oh, for goodness sake. Can you not find... Can you not get help from a doctor or something? The killer's name is here. Somewhere in this data. And I, I know just who have to it find is. It. Find it before it's too late. So does... Uh, One last thing, sir. What's her name? You should be careful not to overindulge in you know what. So this guy's a figment of his imagination. Very dangerous. That didn't click to me at first, but it'll end up killing yeah. you if you're not careful. That would be most unfortunate, sir. Right, uh, I want clues. Right, uh, analyze. I could just speed through this and get to the point, but I want to do everything the way I was. Well, do I really need to? I don't know. Yeah, that doesn't mean anything. This is Harry was in record mode when I was fighting with the killer. Perhaps there's something on it. Play it. How do I play it? Analyze, yeah. Play it. The sword was already in Paco's office. It's got nothing to do with the killer. The gun the killer left at the Blue Lagoon. Perhaps there's some way of tracing its history. Impounded in a police case five years ago, the Only gun is still years. supposed to be in police custody. Who checked it out? If not a cop. Yeah. No name, no, no stuff. Right, the tickets. Yep. Two receipts from the same gas station. Might be near the killer's home. Devils. Uh, 
Of course there wouldn't be. That doesn't get us anywhere. What a weird face for him to make. But look, this narrows it down there. The killer lives in this zone. 342 people live around there. Not good enough. Gotta find a means of identifying the killer more precisely. Oh, don't you worry, Norman. We'll get it. Fifteen percent caught. What? Oh, is that where the thingy trigger is? I don't know. What's this? A funeral for. Ooh. Okay, uh, and this is what looks we need. like the killer is a cop. Carter Blake! <gasps> that would it's explain him. the dead end investigation and his desire to frame Ethan Mars. Eh, uh, investigate further though, because there's no way. It's too obvious, you know. There's only one cop in that geo-profiling zone. Gotcha. Wee. Gotcha. He owns a warehouse on the docks. If I'm wrong, Sean Mars is dead. Oh no. Keep it together, Norman. Look, why is it real people on the wall? I don't get that. Because these people aren't real. These are cartoon guys. They're used by real people. <laughs> mm. Huh? There was something else supposed to happen there, by the way. I don't really know. Well. got a lot to do but I, I've done it before so I'm quite used to it now. Okay, help. Just hang on. Go on, hurry. <laughs> I think the water's rising. Poor, I'm poor, hurrying. Uh, I'll be right back. John. Quick. This place is completely deserted. There's no one around. Dad, Dad, yeah. it's John. He, he found We're going to find out who this kid God, is by the way. If you haven't figured it out already. It was staring you right in the face. Well, be one less greedy mouth to feed, so, if you've never Go seen away, Heavy Rain before, I'm this is for you. you. But if you have, then you know who it was. And I think it's the best person it could possibly be. It's just incredible story, Heavy Rain. Because when I first saw this, I had no idea that it was him. I had no idea. But here we go. Time for the big reveal. I tried, John. I really tried. But he wouldn't come. I cannot Please believe die, it was him Please. first time I played. I cannot believe or seen it. Ready? Don't. <gasps> Don't forget about me, Scotty. Scotty. Have you clicked who it is yet? Oh, ho, 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 ho. That's just the best. That is the best thing ever. I mean, it's horrible, but to make him the killer. It's just brilliant. Because throughout the whole game, you had no idea it was him. And if you still don't know who it is, give us the scene. That is so sad. And he had, he kind of had a just reason for doing it, even though it's horrible what he did. Like, he did it because his dad never saved him or saved his brother you know so he was finding a parent worthy of saving him and the killer is scott shelby wow i mean i knew that already but if you never knew that do you not think that's incredible that is just awesome like totally the best person to be it
get rid of this. So you can also see where he collected all these clues from, and he got them all together, and got rid of, like, amazing. So we did that, remember, and she got rid of, this was when he was looking after the baby, and I got that trophy, it was awful. Uh, yeah, so he got, she got, he got rid of her, her husband's phone. This is from Hassan's shop, way, way back at the start. When we were just getting to like this guy and just getting to know this guy, yep. There it is. Unbelievable. Could you imagine how he must feel, like knowing that that was his uh, killer? He was the killer he faced with, and then this letter was from his girlfriend, well, his make-believe girlfriend or whatever. That will be why he killed her, you know? Because he didn't want evidence getting away and whatever else. Oh, it's just so awesome. So this was some... Now this bit I don't really click because he was with me the whole time. I didn't see him do this. And I was with him because I was playing as him, so I don't understand that. Like, this, this bit really doesn't make sense to me, but it's still awesome. I don't want to burn the picture, it's a lovely memory of what you once used to be. How did, uh, did he kill her? Your la last living ma la relative and you killed her. What I don't understand is how Madison knew who he was. That's what I want to know. Because she, she was like, I know who he is. And this was his last crime. Oh, saucy pictures. Hopefully not too bad. So the only person that didn't go to the club was Ethan. Why didn't you give him a trial in the club, Scott? You nasty man. Right, now we get dramatic time. Playing as Madison now. Yes. You're going she's going to bust your you right open, man. Nasty man. But you can understand why, but still Shelby, Shelby, ooh, Shelby. Now, the first time I did this, it was very frustrating to do. Now, there's one thing that I don't know if you noticed, but it says Mars on the wall. Like, I don't understand why it says Mars on the wall. Like, Ethan Mars? I mean, what the heck? Oh, there we go, I already made a mistake. I was too busy thinking about why the wall said Mars. Now, they did that in GTA uh, 4. They had protagonist names on the wall, but this isn't a game like that. Oh, for goodness sake, I did this fine the first time. Oh, I'm finally. Touch, girl. Yes, you have. That took hundreds of tries. Awful. So the first oh, time I was here, apartment. looked around a wee bit. It's not there really nice. Must be something that'll tell me where Sean Mars is. Hey, what are you doing? Open the cupboard. A cop's uniform. Always trust a cop. Of course. That's why he? children went with him. He was dressed as a cop. That's such a shame, but it's so so obvious. I, I feel like, well, well, what do you call it? The Joker and Batman did the same sort of thing. He dressed up as a cop, and he was like, always trust a cop or something like that. So, you know, it's like, yeah.
Now I know the password. Shit, it needs a password. You should know the password too, basically. Uh, but it's not this. I know what it is. Do you know what it is? That's it. Got it. Max. The name John gave to his paper dogs when he was a child. What the hell is that? It's the address. An address. It's got to be where Sean Mars is. Hurry. There's no time to lose. Oh, but there is time to lose, you know. So you found my little secret. No, it's Scott, over, you were Scott. such a good guy. All those children killed just to find a father capable of saving his son? Shut up! Oh, poof. You don't understand. He's not really had to There's take his child left. recently. There might still be time to save him. Let him go. Do what your father couldn't do. Surprised that, well, that would lead back to him, you know, I guess. Get in there. He would tell her a better way of leaving no evidence, you know. Oh. Smart girl. Yes, we need to get out of here because the place is on fire. <coughs> yep, told you. It was such a nice house, Scott. Why did you have to ruin it? I don't get that scene. It's just like all, uh, what's? Just like all, some something or other. <coughs> what next? Hey, there's a gas canister. That's totally good. It's a good thing. There's a gas canister. Excellent. Now instead of going out because we can't get out, I know what to have to do. This you would get a trophy for doing this, which I've already got, so yeah, I don't have to do it again, but I have to do it again to make sure she lives. You get me? That's it, clear it out, clear it out. Do 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 Excellent. <laughs> Yay, as simple as that. <coughs> and she's alive, you see? It was all worth it. <coughs> Poor Madison, but at least she's alive. One last thing. One last thing. 
Who do you think we'll call? We'll call Ethan. I know where Sean is. I've got to tell Ethan. Hello? Ethan, it's Madison. How does he I know he where have Sean is. Number? He's at 852 Theodore Roosevelt Road. He's still alive. You can still save him. I'm on my way. Be careful, Ethan. He's dead. The killer's still out there. No one's gonna stop me from saving my son. What a brave man. But he's dead. I like how nobody's questioning if she's okay in that. When she comes out coughing from the building or whatever it is. There's also debris everywhere, like they're just standing there in in flames. So yeah, now that Sean, look at him. He's still alive, just. So now we're going to save Sean, hopefully. This is the actual end. Oh, it's going to be mental. I've been looking for a long oh, Shelby. Long time, Ethan. Looking for a father that would be able to do what mine could not do. Sacrifice himself in order to save his son. Oh. <laughs> oh, I searched. Searched and searched. And then, I remembered you. So he was there, you see? There's Grace, and there he is. <sighs> Way back then, oh. Oh. Did you set up the car as well? All those murders, just to find a father capable of saving his son. Just to find a father? Do you have any idea how it feels to be a worthless nothing in your father's eyes? Believe me, I've suffered just as much as my victims. Oh. I finished your damn trials. Now give me back my son. He's there. All you have to do is open that grit. It's meant not to think you used to be a cop. It's just me. He's going to shoot me. No, oh, Jaden. Yes. Jaden, 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 Norman, Jaden, Jaden, Norman, Jaden. Oh, this is nightmarish. Gotta open this goddamn grate. Gotta find something fast. There it is. Uh. He's so weak, man. Did he get it? I see him, Sean. Yes, Sean. I see his face. Come on, Ethan. Yes. No. Oh. Whew. Please tell me he's alive. God, fast pace now. Come on. 
Oh, I need the missed out. Oh, shake, 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 shake. Okay. Always there, yeah. Just follow the news, and, and you'll be fine. You've been doing it for most of the game. Oh, down. Uh, side. How can they not notice this? Hello? There's stuff falling from up here, you know? How's the helicopter not noticing this? Oh, up. Oh, I messed that up. Oops. Didn't mess that up though. Take uh, your positions. Suspect and now we're on to Madison. Armed and dangerous. All personnel are ordered to shoot to kill. I repeat, shoot to kill. Ash, Madison doesn't in position. do anything. Yes, no, They're ready on your command. Perfect. He won't get away this time. We'll gun him down as soon as he shows his face. I'm confused though. He has hey, to save Sean. You there? What are you doing? I'm so Lieutenant, confused. I've missed out a point. My name is Madison Page. I'm a journalist. I have proof that Ethan Mars is innocent. He's not the origami Ash, killer. What is a journalist doing here? I thought I told everybody to keep their mouths shut. Now get her out of here. I don't want her getting in the My way. My son okay, should Lieutenant. be alive, but I need to see All him. All right, come on. You're about to make a terrible mistake, Lieutenant. Ethan Mars is innocent. I can prove it. Right, oh. uh, there's more of this. Uh, I'm getting kind of confused by the order of things. Because there's a bit where Ethan has to give G, uh, Sean oxygen. Oh, I messed that up. Oh. This is crazy. Oh, here we go. R1. L1. Down. Don't help me, son, please. Down. Breathe. Down. Good. Gotta breathe. L L one. Down. No sugar. L one. Down. Good. Uh, R one. L one. Down. Oh sugar. R one. L one. Down. I need to hold it. Down. Down. He is Don't alive. Worry Don't worry about it. He is alive. Please. Just love him and he'll come back. Sean, no. Don't <laughs> He's okay. He's alive. Don't worry. Hopefully. Come on, Sean. Come on, Sean. Come on, Sean. Come on, Sean. Yes! Yes! <laughs> yes! Everything's coming together. Oh, oh, Sean! Oh! Oh! I thought you were gone. Yes. Dad. I knew you'd come and save me. Oh. And now back to the fast paced madness, is it? Or is it? No, wait. No, he's about to die. Sean, listen. You are the best thing that's ever happened to me in my life. I want you to know that whatever happens, I love you more than anything in the world. I. I'm not dead. He's not dead. Yes! I took the poison an hour ago. So Scott has a heart after all. And I'm not dead. <laughs> oh. Ash, get her out of my face. No. Mars didn't do it for Christ's sakes. He's innocent. <laughs> Hey, yeah, you take doing? that, you nasty man. Oh, I didn't realize I had to drive. I had no idea I had to drive. 
And she crashed. Holy crap. <sighs> what do we do, Lieutenant? Attention all personnel. Hold this your guy fire. is I main repeat, people. Hold your fire. Madison? I still have to get back to school. What's going on? Jade. The uh, They're out there. They have the building surrounded. They'll shoot you if you go outside. I'll go out alone. I'll talk to them. I'll explain. You'll be dead before you can open your mouth. Look. We'll all go out together. We'll, we'll all go our hands out in the air and together. They can't possibly shoot us. I have the evidence that proves your innocence. Thank you, Madison. I love you. You just let your son lie there? Listen. I'm sorry I didn't trust you. I was only thinking about Sean, and I thought... You should be hugging him and putting your coat over him. That's He's okay. blinking ill, man. The only thing that matters is that you saved your son. Nope, we need to get back to this mental mess. Oh, God, he's got that now. That looks like a good TV. Oh, good God, no. Did I just get hammered in the head? Did I just get hammered in the head? No, wait, no, I didn't. Thank God. Right. Yes. Now this is a bit I'm a bit like now, I could get a trophy here, but I can't do it Please. just now. Save me. Cause this the story don't help. Like, I get a trophy if I save him, but that's that's we'll do that in a minute, okay? That's such a shame. He had just such a hard time. He had the evidence in that as well, you know? Whew. This is the perfect ending though. Just wish Scott was alive to see it. <laughs> no, he's evil. He killed a lot of people. He just wanted love. He just wanted a father that loved. And he got that through Ethan. But seriously, like, so I have to I have to go back and get that trophy and also make sure there that the origami killer morning, wins. The but I saved the kid. Found Sean Mars alive more than four days and I got four heroes. Yes. Well Was there anything else? The yes, Heavy Rain Hero. The There's four more trophies, case was or three more trophies. Only by the bravery of Ethan Mars, who the police believed at one point to be the killer. It is no doubt due to his great courage and tenacity that he succeeded in foiling the plans of the origami killer. Okay, Glenn the Sanders. commissioner presented him with an official apology today. Our main headline today. It is reported that the police have identified the man thought to be the origami killer. Scott Shelby, 48, is a former police lieutenant who claimed to be a private eye hired by the families of the killer's victims. <sighs> Shelby was killed during a massive police operation, but further details have not yet been released to the public. Hey. <sighs> oh, this looks nice. So is this Madison's? Where is this? Let's just say a friend of a friend let me jump in line. If we like it, it's ours. I don't understand that's similar to her old apartment. <laughs> Sean's so happy and alive. It's great. Hey, Dad! I think I found my room! <laughs> well, what do you think? It's perfect, Ethan. Oh. We'll be able to forget what happened. He looks so tidy we'll and clean again. We'll lead a normal life. And one day, it'll all just seem like a bad dream. Hopefully. We've earned the right to be happy now, Ethan. Hey. All three of us. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> There's that laugh again. Oh, Ethan. What about Grace? She believed you were the guy. She's a nasty mum. Oh, there's that laugh again. What's going on with this laugh? It's scary. 
Let's talk tonight. Who's on this? Our well, guest today is on the cover of today's World Magazine this week and has been hailed by the whole nation as a new hero for our times. Yes. Astonishingly, he almost single-handedly ended the sinister series of killings by the man known as the Origami Killer and saved the life of young Sean Mars. His determination, courage, and intelligence have won our admiration. Yay! Norman Jaden. Yay! Good evening. <laughs> Great guy. I oh, love him. <laughs> Wait, what? He didn't say anything. Oh, we're going back here. Uh, usually you're supposed to take your pants down before you do the toilet. Oh, you're taking drugs, right. Four buttons on a shirt. <laughs> Eight buttons on a shirt, actually. Yes. Are you going to... Yes, Norman. My hero. <laughs> Norman, you're a great man. How is he going to live now, though? Wait, has he got a better office now? What's going on? Hey, hey, look at this. What a great guy. Ha ha ha. He's controlling that. <laughs> What's this? Wait, he's going to give up on that too now? No, that's too awesome. <gasps> He's seeing the tank in real life. Oh god. This is weird. What? What? And finally, Scott, no wait, John Shepherd. I thought it was Scott, but it's not, it's John. Still heavy rain. Is, does it ever sun in this game? Is it always just heavy rain? There's Scott. Why is he not buried with his brother? Remembered for what he was good for, not for what he was bad for. I wonder who did that? Who bought the grave that? Did his mum do that? Scott Shelby. Mm. 2011 this game was played in. Wow. October as well. I see oh god. I'm a father too. Written and directed by David Cage. Oh, so this is just the, the end screens now. Right, so I'll let this play out and I'll talk at the end once it's over. Well, no, wait. 